If you've got kids that are struggling with reading, stick with me on this video. My name's Erica. I homeschooled my six kids for 24 years and two of my kids had dyslexia. And so we went through quite a bit of stuff to help them mitigate their dyslexia. And through the years between the therapy that we had them in and other things that I read and learned and did with them, I've learned a lot about helping kids learn to read. But last week, I had the opportunity to talk to Dr. D. Tadlock, who is the founder of Read Write. And my mind is kind of blown by what I've learned. D. is a woman who had a PhD in reading when her young child started to have problems with reading. And she thought, well, how great that I'm his mom. I can help him. And what she found was everything that she'd been trained for did not help her child. And when she went to special ed at her school to see what they could do to help, and she went to observe, she saw that what they did was exactly what she had been taught in school, and it wasn't helping either, which put her on a quest to figure out what is it that kids need to help them overcome learning problems? And this turned into establishing Read Right, which she created in 1991. I spent three hours <laughs> listening to her explain about what she discovered and what Read Right does. The short version that I want to explain to you is that we are in a society that believes that reading ins instruction is explicit, that you are going to teach the letters and the sounds and how to sound things out, and that this is all going to turn into kids being able to read. And although some kids can, the truth apparently is that actually a tremendous amount of learning to read is an implicit internal brain process with your neural pathways blazing a trail so that your child can do something that is more personal and internal than anything that you can actually get from the explicit instruction that we all are familiar with. And this is why you sometimes see kids who you know, their parents are like, they just one day they knew how to read. Yeah, because for some reason, somehow, you managed to have an environment that nurtured that implicit internal ability, and then their brain was able to do it. I'm going to have to make more parts to this. ReadWrite.com, and they're giving away 10 free evaluations. So I know there's a lot of you, and 10 isn't that many. I'm going to leave instructions in the caption for you, but follow for part two.